Hello guys, Christian Chef here. I'm invited by Santi Santiago and his friend Jordan on a trip to crawfish fishing and mushroom foraging. Okay, going in. Okay, we're gonna go into the water. It is quite deep. Whoa, this water is so cold. Yeah, it's wearing so the cold. waiter, you can still feel the icy coldness I, of the I, water. Right now, I feel like I'm soaking wet. Yeah, gee. Ouch. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, yeah, this is cold thing. Damn, this water is cold. They look like a cabazon. Freshwater yeah, cabazon. It looks exactly like it, even. Dude, those are some nice crawfish. Oh, they. Yep. Freshwater cabazon. <laughs> it's actually freshwater scoping you fish. How do you tie this thing on? Yeah. Wow, look at this. There's so many more creatures in here. Oh no, those, those are fish. Holy. That's so cool. I'm gonna get more under the water. I almost got away. I caught him as he was leaping out. Oh my goodness. <laughs> That's crazy. Look how big this thing is. Look at the claw. Like, that's my thumb comparing to the size of it. Let me see that. So, hope, so no cool. parasites either. I think there's a little bit. Oh, a little bit. I think that's a, a sort of a tendency that they have with this this kind of crayfish. There's always a little parasite. Very blue. Yeah. We got a little steelhead in here. Look at that. Okay, we'll let you go soon. No fishing is allowed in this creek. We're gonna re release all the fish that in the trap. The same with this steelhead. Whoa, that's so fast. That's a pretty good haul. That's at least I say five pounds. A lot deeper there. Maybe seven pounds. I don't know. That's a lot of them. Okay, so this is the male. Yeah, male, female. By looking at these two little legs down here. Nice. Yep. Oh, these ones are so weird too. Yeah. This is where they carry their eggs, right? Have you ever, ever caught one with the eggs? They, I used to catch them all the time. With wow. Them. Well, that's, isn't that cool? Like a pouch full of eggs just crazy. under the belly. Like that belly. one video you had with the crab that had a crazy amount. Oh yeah, that was pretty recent. Yeah. Did you watch that? Yeah, that's yeah. crazy. I was like, holy, yeah, that's crazy. Yeah, that was so crazy. I'm like, oh, I, that was the first time I've seen a rock crab with so many eggs. The one eggs. you pulled out of the rock? Yeah. yeah. The eel video. Here. Oh, oh. Yuppies. So cool.
king fillet right here. Oh, this one is big. Oh shoot. Oh well. Recover this back. I found one Kimbale. Uh, it's one of those again. Hmm, the lemony one again. Yeah. Nope. This is the Super Mario mushroom. Apparently you can boil and distill the poison away, but I am not going to risk doing that. There's another one here. Ho ho. There's a bunch more of these Amnita. Another mushroom here. Over there. And as we come up, there's a few over there. One, two, three, four, five. All together. And there's one more here. Holy moly. There's a big. That's crazy. Jesus, that's a big one too. I'm taking a pretty one. Oh, look at this. Some crazy mushrooms here. Amnita mushrooms. That got really warmy. Crazy. You don't mind if I put the store, like your cafe, on the, in the video? Yeah. Cool. Olive oil. Olive oil. Do you want to take this to like make the your pizza? Yeah. Are you going back to San Francisco? Uh, San Jose. Oh, San Jose. Yeah. 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 Oh. Wow. It will grow a little bit, probably like yeah. house size or something like that. But Thank you. Of course, yeah. This is the only puccini that we found yesterday. Um, I'm gonna clean it up and get it prepared for the pizza. Puccini's cap and the underside. Bug has eaten it a little bit, but overall is in a, in a really good shape. Oh no! I think I may not be using the cap after all. I think there's warm inside. Uh, too bad. You know what? A little warm in there, so get rid of that extra. Let it rest. The 
quick way to dispatch them. Just hold them like this. This is their butt, middle leaf. Hold on to it, do it, twist. Just pull it out, cut line. Twist. Steam this for about five minutes. This is all the meat, uh, this much of crawfish head. Porcini, crawfish, mozzarella, and homemade pizza sauce. Shout out to Axel, Santi's brother, for making us the, the pizza dough. Because, uh, yeah, I'm a total noob when it comes to dough making. And with his help, I'm able to make a good pizza today. So thank you, Axel, and sing. thank you, uh, Santi. Crawfish tail. That's a porcini. Mm. Mm. <clears throat> it's 11.30, uh, almost midnight, so I will save this for tomorrow, tomorrow's lunch. Alright, uh, thanks guys. Ciao.